GPT Crawler is a new open source project that creates custom versions of ChatGPT. These custom versions of ChatGPT are called as GPTs. These GPTs crawl web content and they allow users to generate personalized chatbots focused on particular topics or websites. All you need to do is to provide a URL and this tool GPT crawler is going to generate a knowledge base to build a specialized GPT usable in website and applications. So it will be a sort of widget you can include it in your website. The only downside I see with this sort of project is that it is based on OpenAI and I believe you would need to have a paid OpenAI account but still this is where the generative AI is going where you would have these models and these tools using the models behind the scenes. So model will not be a product rather the applications and crawlers like these or custom built applications will be the actual product using these models behind the scene. Hopefully other open source models will be integrated with these sort of tools. Now the way it works is that it drastically lowers the barrier to entry for creating a personalized up-to-date chatbot custom to specific web resources. And API accessibility means that this customized assistant can be easily embedded into products. And there are a lot of other good features uh, for this GPT crawler and you can even install it locally. And let me show you how you can do it. So if you go to their GitHub repo and I'll drop the link in video description, all you need to do is to first git clone this repository and then just install the dependencies with npmi. Make sure that you meet the prerequisite of having Node.js greater than 16 and you would need a good GPU for this too. Once that's done, you need to configure the crawler and then you need to give uh, these website links which you want uh, to make your crawler out of. And then there are other options which you can set if you want, uh, as which URL you want to crawl, pattern to match, and all that stuff. And then you need to start your crawler with npm start. I have tried it out locally, but I have faced few issues, so I'll be making another video to show you how to install it locally. But I would rather prefer that they don't use OpenAI instead of. Uh, you know, they would do something else instead of OpenAI. There are other alternate met methods too, like Docker and stuff, but they are quite cryptic and I don't see any um, helpful information on their GitHub repo. Once that's done, you would need to upload this data to OpenAI and this is where you would need their keys and all that stuff and tokens. Anyway, so let me show you a demo of it, which they have provided on this GitHub repo. So, if you go to this website and you can access it from their GitHub repo, this is where you would just start running this assistant. So what they have done is they have pointed the GPT crawler to a website builder.io and on the basis of it, the GPT crawler has built this chatbot. We can't run it because for that this to run, we would need that GPT plus, which is around 20 to $30 per month. So as I said, good tool, but still the dependency of this paid OpenAI is not really um, good enough to run it uh, in production, in my opinion. Anyway, let me know your thoughts, keen to know them. And if you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you very much.